Good morning, everyone. Today, I have to go to the cold storage again. What am I going to do? I'm going to get a new sample, a type of beef that has a price so high you wouldn't even dare to look at it. Then, I'm going to try out how it tastes. If you cut the beef into thin slices like the kind served at Yoshinoya, and it's from the US, then at this price it must be unimaginably low, right? We need a type of meat that is so affordable that it scares everyone. So today, I'm going to bring you a product that I will first try out myself. I won't just try to calculate everything on my own for my clients, so today I will invite two clients to taste our Angus tomahawk. The price has actually doubled. I don't really want to eat it, but some clients have told me that my products are either top-tier Japanese Wagyu or Angus that can be used as steak, and they need something in between. Right? Let me solve this problem. Everyone wait a moment. I've arrived at the warehouse. Let's take a look at what these are. Let's unbox it, starting with this one. This customer placed an order this morning, and I happened to see it while I was staying here today, so I brought it with me. Now I'm trying to contact the customer, but they haven't replied. They placed the order at 6 o'clock this morning, and I just happened to come to the warehouse today, where they brought it over. They ordered a free pork. This is the 10 kilogram barley beef, and this is the new product we are going to test, which is the Angus beef from Tyson that is extremely cheap, with 30% fat. Angus beef brisket, this is usually tough in restaurants. If I can handle it, I'll just go back to the website and do an unboxing for everyone. Hey, today I'm bringing you a new product, this American beef. The price is so low that you can't imagine it. The fat content of the beef brisket is about 30%. They say it's around 30%. I'm here to personally test something that isn't meant for high-end consumers like you. For me, it's about solving some people's issues, allowing them to recognize new products and enjoy eating meat while discussing their feelings. Today, I won't share this test with clients. I'll just enjoy it myself. This is definitely a piece of chicken meat cut for you and me to use. So you need to have a meat slicer or a grinder. Well, grinding is also fine. You can chop it down and then slice it for you all. We have now pan fried a piece, and I can tell you that the taste is just like what you find outside. After drinking some water, everyone can see that I can only say that I think we should eat out less. Make a beef brisket pot to eat. Ah, this is the final product, the beef brisket vermicelli pot. I've eaten too much beef. This is Angus, and it's very tender. In the next video, see my Sunday.